Happy Valentine's Day. Yes, this is very appropriate for right now because it's definitely not the middle of fucking November. What is good with y'all boys today? We're back here once again in Scratch. But today we will be actually outside the website because I have found a glitch where you are able to download the oldest version of Scratch. As you can see, here's my downloads folder and I literally had to download so much stuff just to get this working. But if we click right here, as you can see, if we open it, it's very glitchy. Everything looks very different. We don't even have the whole screen over here. Uh, there's no cat there anywhere. That's just there's just a go button. So I'm gonna click the go button. There is a heart. Happy Valentine's Day. Yes, this is very appropriate for right now because it's definitely not the middle of fucking November. So let me just quickly create a new uh, project. Uh, and as you can see, everything is blank right now. And I looked up a tutorial how to get this working because it is so unbelievably complicated to do anything in this outdated old ass version. So how to get like a sprite is clicking this cat button over here so if we click the cat as you can see we are we have a cat not the one we're used to but the one from above so if you double click it as you can see here are the blocks which are not so good and it's once again very complicated to get everything even working so today the challenge is simple i'll try to create some sort of game on this stupid ass website because i like to suffer oh my god oh. And now I just want to put this, I just want to put this over here. Oh, there we go. Even putting the blocks into other blocks like that is the simplest thing ever. And it's also very complicated because it is once again, very outdated. So it's very glitchy as well. Joe Biden, Joe Biden. I have finally managed to make some sort of game. It is absolutely trash and garbage. But you know what, what else can you expect from this, this website that was made in 2003? So let me just click cat. So as you can see, the cat is following our cursor. And as you can see, there is another cat on the screen. And basically what I mean is that if the, the, the cat I'm controlling touches this cat, it will basically change size. So as you can see, it is the normal size right now. But if we touch, nothing happens. Hold on, let me fix it. Okay, it's working now, as you can see, Whenever I'm not touching the cat, nothing basically happened, but if I do touch the cat, as you can see, our cat is getting smaller, as you can see, it's, it's way smaller right now, I can't even see it, and oh my god, this is so terrible. But considering I made this uh, with a program and a tool that was made like 20 years ago, I'm sure you can understand that it is at least something, because it is definitely not easy to get it working. <laughs> what is happening? There are so many lists on the screen. No, turn them off. What? What did I just turn on? No. How do I get back? I just want my game back.